Hi, my name is Miss Spencer, and I will be teaching your student current issues this year. Just wanted to go through a few things that um, might be helpful, and that is um, that we have certain units of stu study that we do, and those are um, news media and bias, world history with current global issues, U.S. and current national issues, American government and current political issues, economics, and current economic crisis. So I'll be using a variety of instructional methods. Um, we will do most of our work around the setting of a project-based learning idea. So students will be asked to complete small tasks that lead up to the final project. And I'm hoping to get a little feedback from the students in our early weeks to see what they would like to learn about um, the most. Grade calculations, it will be 25% formative and 75% semester. This is not an EOC um, course. And um, of course there are work habits that are included in their report card. And that would be responsibility, participation, interpersonal skills and assignment completion. Help sessions, I'll be available to help outside of class during tutorial times. And um, those are listed on my It's Learning page, and I'll be able to help Tuesday through Thursday uh, before school. I will use It's Learning to communicate with students. All of my messages will go through It's Learning, and my main communication with parents will be via email. I am always just an email away, and I will also send out some notes to parents via It's Learning. So um, if there's a big project, uh, deadline coming up. I might send that out through It's Learning. It's Learning is your best friend. I'll place everything there. Everything your student needs to know about class should be in It's Learning and it'll be dated with the correct date and I will have plans out there uh, a week in advance and resources will be there on the planner for each date. Um, it's a great idea to have your student go through these with you, the um, it's learning process uh, at the beginning of the year, if um, they can do that. Supplies uh, or students' expectations, um, uh, the face-to-face, -face prepared participation, um, follow the school rules, virtual instruction, um, basically virtual instruction is do your best work and um, get things turned in on time. And um, if I ask for students to give me feedback, um, that, that is huge for me. So I would love to have communication in regard to that. Classroom supplies, you need a notebook. Um, this year also due to the pandemic, I would, I would recommend and, and they have told us that we really need to be aware of sharing supplies. So pens, pencils, paper. Um, BYOT is highly recommended, so if you have your own device, that is going to be a huge thing um, that would be great, greatly advised that you bring in. Um, as well, at the start of each project, you're going to have a choice board, so you're going to get to decide how you present your project. So depending on what you need, um, and you'll have plenty of time to, to know what you need to bring in. I would love it if anyone would like to donate Kleenex, hand sanitizer, wipes, etc. That'd be awesome. My contact information, there's my email address, my room, my phone number. Um, I'll respond to all emails within 24 hours. Um, county policy of virtual, otherwise 48 hours. If you do not hear from me, please call me. There are times when a parent's email is regarded as spam and therefore I may miss it entirely. And lastly, thank you. And I can't wait to see you guys. Um, I am so excited about this class. I am excited about um, that it's going to be fun and interesting because it is current issues and um, I think it'll be a great year. Uh, feel free to check out my message up here and uh, it's just a little personal message that tells a little bit about me. Okay.